face. I never looked at his face, I just looked at the gun. I still can't think about it all, because it's just so scary. Police searched the home of the suspect. Federal agents are examining the 22 caliber handgun they believe was used. Students and parents told us there was a history of bad feelings between the suspect and his victims. The hundreds of parents outside Chardon High School wanted to make sure their kids were safe. School Superintendent Joe Burgeon. I hope every parent, if you haven't hugged or kissed your kid in the last couple days, you take that time. The suspect could be arraigned as early as tomorrow in Scott. Police are sifting through emails and computer files of the suspect, hoping to see just how much planning went into this attack. Michelle, thank you very much. We have late details on that suspect. Correspondents Bob Orr and John Miller tell us that he comes from a broken home and lives with his grandparents. Their sources say that he told police that he was bullied and teased at school, and the shooting was in retaliation for that.